Hi guys, my name is Mohammad Naveed and in this lecture I am going to teach you rectangle and rectangle primitive tool. So what is the difference between rectangle and rectangle primitive tool we will discuss in this lecture. So first let's take a first object that is rectangle. So this object and now I am taking second object which is rectangle primitive tool now you will ask me sir what is the difference between rectangle and rectangle primitive tool because when we see say, so they both look same and they both have same name rectangle rectangle so what is the difference so let me tell the difference so what I do I first take the selection tool and as you can see that I have taken my selection tool so this is definitely this is the normal rectangle but what is the difference in primitive rectangle see here when I am taking the selection, selection tool and when I click and drag you can see that when it, it comes with the you can say dots four dots and when I click and drag so I can make any shape I like so this is the difference that if I talk about this uh, normal rectangle so it does not have any kind of uh, points but when I am talking about this rectangle primitive tool so it has four uh, you can say uh, points by which I can manipulate it I can make any shape I like so this is a big difference in rectangle and rectangle primitive tool now we know what is rectangle and what is rectangle primitive tool now the time has come when we should learn the properties of rectangle so we need to come here and I just call it like this okay what I do I first talk about this one this is rectangle normal rectangle so let me take the selection tool I have the I have selected this object and as I selected this object you can see that the properties of this object has come here now the first property is that if let me talk about this uh, position and size let's suppose if I want to change the position by x axis y axis so I can easily do here if I want to change the width you no need to make another object if you if you if, uh, if you commit a mistake and uh, for example if you want to change the width or height so you no need to make a whole new object if you come in the properties you can easily change the width and the height of your object then we have the stroke color what is mean of stroke color stroke color means the color which comes outside or you can say the outline color in easy word we can say the color of the outline as you can see the blue color is the outline color if you want to change the color which is inside in fill color so you can easily do this if you want to change the stroke size stroke size means the size of the outline if you want to change the size of your outline you can easily do here you can also type the that you can say number or you can scrub this and you can see the difference that what I mean you can also change the the, the type of the line you want for example dotted line star line and in line you want so mm, th this was the properties of selection uh, sorry a uh, rectangle tool now we should talk about rectangle primitive tool I've selected this object and you can see the all the things are same except this we have one more option that is rectangle options what does it mean of that if I click and drag so you can see the difference so I have two ways to manipulate this object the first is by, by by taking the selection tool and or or by you can select this object and you can scrub this scroll line so basically this was a big difference between rectangle and primitive rectangle tool now you know how to use this in your program or in your project so this was about rectangle a primitive rectangle tool I hope you have understood for more videos you can come to my website www.navidplace.com Allah Hafiz Fiyamala Inshallah I will meet you in the next lecture till then Allah Hafiz